me, it's your boy Beardsnack, and I wanted to talk about some new features that came to OBS Studio recently, um, specifically for Mac. Uh, I don't see anybody else talking about these features, these new uh, additions or updates that have happened to the Mac version, and I'm hoping that I might be the first to discuss it, and if not, uh, let's discuss it together, of course, and if I leave anything out, please leave comments uh, or your own video and links to them. I'd love to hear more about it, uh, but let's get right into it, okay? I'm gone off the screen, no more, no more beard snack on webcam. This is my desktop, and right up here, we'll see, this is where we would usually see the, the system tray, right? Um, and next to it is another item that I had never seen before just recently pop up in a new version of OBS. I actually didn't see this until I got my first M2 and um, that when I first noticed this new menu here and it's got some wonderful little features that are not available in the OBS app. But for some reason, they are available here in this drop-down menu. I can't say why that is. If this is a Mac OS feature or a OBS feature, but I'm leaning towards this is an OBS feature. Um, and the first thing that you'll notice is, hey, there is a presenter overlay option which is absolutely bonkers because a lot of us set up our own overlays or purchase them. Now OBS has its own? That's just weirdly fantastic. I mean, if you're a simple person and you want and you like simple things, this is going to be for you. And here I am. I'm back on the screen. That's me right there. It's a simple, small, circular picture, kind of like a green screen setup sort of thing. Um, the best part about it is this is not in the stream. Okay, this is not like a scene that is created or, or uh, an item that is unique to just OBS. This is actually on my desktop. Like I see it on my desktop. There, I can interact with it by clicking on it and moving it around. I can put it anywhere, literally anywhere. Can I resize it? No. Can I change effects or filters on it? I'm sorry, no. Um, wow. <laughs> That's interesting. Whoa. All right. Um, can I change the background? No. Um, not that I know of. If anybody does know, please drop it in the comments or link me a video showing me how to do that because I would like to know how to do that. Anyway, I'm putting myself down here, nice and out of the way. You'll also notice that there is a preview of the stream. Anyway, uh, the other the other overlay option is large. Now I hope you're sitting down because this is probably going to knock your socks off. All right, are you ready? Are you ready for this? Here we go. Now, first of all, that transition, that transition is epic. That is one of the best transitions. Oh my God. Secondly, this is not a green screen. I do not have a green screen. I don't. This is done with my FaceTime camera on my M3 MacBook Pro. And it turned me into a news anchor. And there behind me, is my screen. I, I'm blown away 
Let's see that transition in reverse. What the? Are you for real? Are you are you for real? Damn. <laughs> Damn. Oh. That is awesome. That is freaking insane. That is so nice. That is bonkers. What the? Crazy. Um, moving on ahead. It shows you if I, I can see options to my face, my FaceTime camera. I can, uh, put it into portrait view. I can add studio lighting. I can add reactions. Reactions are cool because then you can go and you can go, ah, thumbs up. Thumbs down. But, um, you can't do that. As far as I know, you can't, you can't do that. That's only I can do that. <laughs> but it's it's pretty neat. What's this? I wish you guys could do that. I just I wish you guys could do reactions like that. Noise. I wonder what it looks like in small overlay. Can we do that in small? No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, okay. The raining one isn't is like no, not so great. The balloon one is not so great. But Nice, legit, and we can do voice isolation, which I always have it set to. So nice. I whoa, 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 whoa. I know what you want. I know what you want, and I'm gonna give it to you. Okay, I know what you want, and I'm gonna give it to you. Okay, here we go. We're gonna do the transition and the reaction at the same time. <laughs> Not great. Not great. Still good. Still good, but not... Okay, anyway. Anyway. What do you think? What do you think? Is that... Is that awesome? That's pretty awesome, right? That... That's pretty awesome. I think. I don't know. I wish there was a way to automate this. So that it would re it would th I could use these with um, like Twitch events, like a new subscriber, new followers, uh, or like uh, um, raids or whatever. It, it would be really nice to do to do that and integrate that in some way. So like you know. Apple, if you're watching, if you're watching Apple, hey, come on. So um, if you enjoyed the content and you like this and you want to see more about this, please like and subscribe. I'll make some more videos about OBS on Mac and other things that I've discovered. Thank you for dropping by. We'll see you next time.